The following program, Bonza, is rated M for mature audiences and contains coarse language and sexual references. All of us, and so say all of us, she's a jolly good lassie, she's a jolly good lassie, she's a jolly good lassie, and so say all of us. Hip hip, hooray! Hip hip, hooray! Hip hip, hooray! Happy birthday. Wouldn't be dead for quids, eh, Bonds? Looks fantastic, Mum. Jeez, how many candles you got there, darling? Thirty-five. That's how old you are, aren't you, you gorgeous girl? Yes, you are. Come again? Well, you know, in doggy years, you multiply by seven. Hey, that's enough for you, sport. You've got your homework to do, remember? Oh, and your present? Yes. I forgot. I wanted to oh, buy it's a special. Little... It's all right. This is from the whole family. It's lovely to have you home again, Pete. And so what'd you get her, Mum? Oh, I thought we'd uh, spoil her for a change. Ooh, so what's new, pig dog? Eh? I got her three visits to Dapper Dog, including two free manicures. They had a special. Oh, no. This is very dandy. We have Punch Dog on board. Oh, With... Terry. Pinky, pinky, pinky. Oh, I told you. Now go and do your homework. Not until we've all made a wish. Well, then. Only as long as I have to, that's for sure. Reject. Oh, yeah. So how long's it been like this? About a week. He's acting really weird. How do you mean? Stop smoking. I started jogging. Well, that's all right. Sure. So why is he drinking heaps then? I don't know. And how come he's getting home from work so late? You know what I reckon? Seeing someone else. Rubbish. No, he is. Definitely doing it. Every night of the week, he's there. That ball away. Just pumping, pumping, never stopping. <laughs> yeah, my hairs are up. Funny. I'm going punch his back over. He's ugly. He's big. He's hurting. It's Real Godzilla. He's <laughs> well, uh, 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 disgusting. I'm disgusting. He's the one who's doing it. I don't want to know. Well, neither does Mum. <laughs> Good one, Pimbo. Reach it! 
subjects you've got, if you really knuckle down, you could study to be a dentist. Well? Well, well what do you reckon? Well, what I was hoping, I'd... you know, what about uh, my singing? What? My singing? As a hobby, sure, but I'm talking about a real job. I'm talking about you being independent. Well, well singing could be a real job, okay? Listen, sport. I don't care that this is your third time round. That I've spent thousands to send you to that snotty joint. I want you to be able to go out there, Tiger, and never let any of those bastards tell you what's what. But you're going to have to put in, change your attitude, pull your finger out, piss this singing bullshit right off, and get down to some bloody hard yakka. Nobody likes a loser, Terry. Nobody. Don't worry, mate. You'll be right. No worries. I'm going to be with you every step of the way. What do you reckon about that? You like your breakfast, don't you, you gorgeous girl? Yes, you are. I was just asking. Fine. You know, just in case. Uh -huh. You just seem a little tense. You're making me tense. I told you, your father and I are fine. It's as though you want something to be wrong. Is it a crime to care? I was worried, that's all. You'd be better off caring about yourself. You can't live off your savings forever. I know, I'm OK. You've got to make up your mind sooner or later. Look, I just got back. I just need a little time to get my head together, OK? I thought that's why you went overseas. Oh, it's a monster. It's a big <laughs> one. You're going to be late again. <laughs> Oh, and where's your soul? Oh, I can't burn it. Can I drink it? What are you doing in that pig star? Cassie, call your father. Yeah, fuck his face. Terribly. I can't push an electrolysis, can I, Mark? Catherine! Catherine, when I ask you to call Terry. your... Don't ask me. While we're on the subject, has anyone seen my pill? Which one? Did you have to open the pill? My sleeping pill. Well, why don't you ask Terry? What are you talking about? Well, he knocks off everything else around here. Crap! Well, where's my sleeping pill? Crap! There's face? a carton in the fridge. I know, it's empty. Bummer! There's milk on the table. Couldn't you just... There's not great milk! You know I can't drink that stuff! What's the problem? Well, Catherine? No problem, Dad. Nothing. I'll be the judge of that. It's just that there isn't any soil milk left, that's all. Why not? It doesn't matter. It, doesn't get, it, was, it was my soil milk. I'm waiting. Your pancakes are going cold. Right. No one is leaving this kitchen till we find out what happened to the soya milk. <laughs> Terry? <laughs> Sorry? Did you drink your sister's soya milk? Uh, no. Well, where is it then? I, um... Yeah? I gave it to Bonzo. <laughs> Well, don't do it again, understand? Right, I'm off, Carl. Well, well, what about your breakfast? No time. Well, you won't forget about dinner tonight. We've got the house to ourselves. Mm. Oh, yeah, right. See ya. Sometimes I think I'm invisible. A ghost. He must think I'm as thick as a brick if he thinks I don't know what he's up to. If he 
he leaves me. Oh, God. Oh, God, please, 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 don't let me end up like Auntie Mark. I can remember visiting her in that place. And the smell. Oh, God, the smell. It smelled like... like... like the men's toilets at the footy. She used to greet me by dancing around the ward, crowing like a rooster. bloody credit it, would you? Turner. Turner, that young smart-ass. Him sitting there surrounded by all that smart-ass computer gear. Five minutes. Just five minutes alone with him and that computer. I'd shove it so far up his ass, his eyeballs would spin. Get the ass after 23 years with that mob. You wouldn't bloody credit it. Just that it's been so long since you and Mum have had a proper holiday. All right, I get the message. You can have a rest if you want to. I'm not a bloody Jerry. I'm not there just, you know. No, but you will be if you keep this up. Bullshit. No pain, no gain. What would happen to Mum if you had a heart attack? Well, get off my bloody back, will you? What are you going to do? That's a 64 bloody million dollar question. It's not that simple. Also got more sick leave than what have you? It isn't as if you haven't got the bloody perks. I just don't know if I'm a very good teacher. Rubbish! So many expectations! You work it out! And you don't enjoy it anymore! I'm bloody sick of this! You're lucky to have a bloody job and a safe one at that! So for Christ's sake, wake up yourself! <laughs> How many times have I told you not to do that with your school bag? Bunsy Bunsy Thong of Death. How's the school play going, Horatio? Still a play, it's a rock opera, dickhead. Mm. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Bunsy, Mr. Bunsy. While we're on the subject, your dad thinks you're spending far too much time on that play and not enough on your study. It's a rock opera, Mum. I don't care. Mum! And because it's your final year, we've decided to ban all television until after the exams. Oh, Mum! No. Oh, poor baby, you'll go with that little telly fix, won't you? Get laugh. How dare you say that word! Now go to your room and do your homework! From Jesus, what do you want? Jesus, tell me. You've got to be careful, you could be dead soon, could well be. Why do you not speak when I hold your life in my hands? How can you stay quiet? I don't believe you understand. We need to crucify him, that's all you have to do. We need to crucify him, that's all you have to do.
Oh, 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 bloody clown! Ah, look at bloody ah, idiot! I already want it. It's just that, yeah, just that I don't want it. That's all. Now you shouldn't have eaten that, Bonds. It's full of sugar. All your teeth are going to fall out now. But don't worry, mate. I'm going to be a dentist. <laughs> Look, Bonzi, I didn't send you to that bloody school so I can be a bloody clown, you bloody idiot. But don't worry, mate. You'll be right. You'll be fine. What do you reckon? What a psycho. felt it. I did. Ever so faintly, but it was there. Nothing. No. No, it can't be. I'll call the vet. It's no good, Mum. She's... Don't be silly. The vet said she had a 50-50 chance. I know. I felt it. Mum. Where the hell is everybody? Ah, oh, there you are. Mum said it was all right. It's not bloody all right. What the hell's Bond's doing in here? I brought her in here. Well, you can just get her out again. 
Ted, she's... You moats all over the bloody carpet. You know I've told you before about letting her sleep in here. Ted, it's bothered. It's my she's... bloody house! Come on, Mungo. Come on, you Mungo. Out of it. Hey? <laughs> come on, Bunch of Scallywag. Come on, come on, come on. <laughs> Jesus, what's all that shit in her mouth? Apparently she ate a whole bottle of my sleeping pills. Hey? Shouldn't we make a walk around or something? But she's... Well, don't just sit there, get the bloody vet! It's dead! a little bit deeper for Bonza. Jesus, babe, it's going to start pissing down again soon. Bonza's thong. Bonza's thong. Bonza's favourite footy. Bonza's favourite footy. Oh, God. I killed her. I killed Bonza. Come on, darling. I killed her. For Christ's sake, Bev, don't be silly. It's always Mum's fault. That's the problem. Hey? I should have known she'd eat them. Well, it's never your fault, is it? Shut up, Kathy. She'd still be alive if it wasn't for me. Don't be silly, doll. That's it. Negate her reality. You'd know all about it, wouldn't you? You'd come back in this house telling us what we should and shouldn't do. You can talk. Look at you. You wouldn't have a bloody clue. You're a perfectly good job and you piss it in the wind. Not a bloody clue. Shut up! Don't you tell me to shut up. Shut up, Terry! I took the pills, it was me, it was my fault! Shut up, Terry! You shut up! Terry, Why did you take them? Terry's fault! I told you to shut up! I had them in my room, she must have found them! Leave him alone! You killed her, you bloody it's idiot! It's bullshit! Leave him alone! I'm leaving him dead! Stop oh. it! He can't breathe! Oh. 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 Oh.
We hope you've enjoyed Bonzo. Next Wednesday, Tracy Ullman stars in a comedy special that takes a satirical swipe at the British class system. Join us for A Class Act next Wednesday night at 9.30. Stay with us now for ABC News and Late Lion.